Hello guys, welcome to Excellence Biomedical Engineering. Uh, on today's video, we will be talking about this small device, which is uh, uh, called Pulse Oximeter. Pulse Oximeter is a non-invasive device which is used in measuring a person's oxygen saturation. So, on today's video, we will be talking about mantling and dismantling of this uh, small device. It is uh, really an important device that uh, is needed in the hospital because uh, SpO2 uh, is one of uh, part of the uh, vital signs measurement that is done by the physicians or nurses in the hospital. So we would like to first of all begin. This one uses uh, battery cells and uh, each of the battery cells is uh, 1.5 volt. So total it uses three volt uh, battery cells so here is the battery pack side and uh, here is where you put your finger and uh, let's begin first of all let us remove this cover top cover so as you can see we have uh, removed the top cover and then what next is that we will uh, remove this one, uh, this layer that is here. You can remove this layer, and uh, this is like protective covering. And so here I got my screws here, and I I'm going to uh, bring up this layer that is here. You see, I will pop up this layer. And uh, let's remove it and then remove it here. And uh, for these ones, we can see, yeah, let's remove it here. Removing this pin sometimes it is very hectic, but uh, yeah, you see, I've removed this one, and uh, remaining this one also. So you've seen, uh, we've removed. This pins. Uh, sorry, it got. Uh, you need to be very careful, otherwise you could spoil this handle here. So so we've seen. This is the device alone, so uh, so what you've seen. So we have completely dismantled this device, as you can see. This is the LED screen, this is the switch button, and uh, this is the uh, circuit board contain all the components. And then this is the uh, this is the LED, LED light, and then this is the sensor that captures the scattered light and then send it to the uh, circuit board and it gets processed and then it will be displayed on the monitor so we are going to uh, this is the covers everything here is intact right now so uh, let us try uh, putting on the battery like this as it is let us see if maybe it, uh, it could work See, the battery is not put in the right position so it doesn't work so now let's yeah it is putting in the right position 
and it works you see this is the led light is down here it is when it shows okay now this sensor that is here this sensor that you see here will measure the amount of light that is absorbed by my finger as you all know the uh, principle of pulse oximetry is that uh, the oxygenated blood absorbs the infrared light while the deoxygenated blood absorbs red light so the sensor calculates the absorbed light and the scattered light and then project it onto the screen as you can see here for example so we are going to uh, keep it now this is the led light this is the sensor and uh, this is the battery pack side and then this is the monitor this is the circuit board and this is the control uh, this is the switch so we will we assemble it back right now so now we will reassemble this device and uh, one of the main most challenging thing in uh, assembling this device is these two pins here they are the most challenging thing in both assembling and uh, the assembling so let's begin with this two of these devices two of these stuff uh, let's say let's begin So now uh, what we do next is that uh, uh, let us close this panel head here let me put this switch button and then I can return let's say for example we do like this like this and then we close it here So, next thing we do is that uh, put this handle here. I think this one is here uh, for this. You see, this one is put in, and then we talk about putting this one here. So we have just
as you can see from here this battery just take a look this one it's like this as you can see from here this one it indicates the head of the battery and then this one indicates here here is the head of the battery now you put the cover back now we have mantled the device completely back again so let's switch it on as you can see and then let me finally put my hands inside you can see So this device you see here, it is a small but mighty device. It is often used every day in the hospitals. So thank you guys for watching Excellence Biomedical Engineering. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to support us by liking this video, comment and share. You can also see from the path of this uh, device is that if you want to rotate the screen like landscape you press it if you want it for uh, portrait you can press it again like you want it for landscape you press it you want it you see as you can see it is displaying that uh, my finger is out it is indicating finger out now once i put my finger and i turn it on it will show I want to change it to portrait, I press it back. Landscape, I press it again, as you can see. Depending on location where I am. If I want to let it stand in my side, then it will show like this. Thank you guys for watching Excellence by Medical Engineering. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe this video. And keep on watching about medical engineering videos for more updates. Press the bell icon. Thank you.